energy transfer in an electric circuit. Try this. Materials Connecting wires Electric cells Electrical resistance Voltmeter A meter Plug key Procedure Connect the circuit as shown in the accompanying figure after taking the components with proper value. Measure the current, I. Also measure the potential difference, VAB, between the two ends, A and B, of the resistance. The potential at A is higher than the potential at B as the point A is connected to the positive electrode of the cell and the point B to the negative electrode of the cell. If a charge Q flows from A to B, work VABQ has been done on Q while going from A to B. Refer to Chapter 3 of Standard 9. From where does the energy come to do this work? The source of energy is the cell. The cell gives this energy through the charge Q to the resistance where work VABQ is performed. If the charge Q flows from A to B in time T, that is, the work is performed in time T, then during that time, the energy VABQ is given to the resistor. What happens to this energy? This energy is received by the resistor and is converted into heat energy. The temperature of the resistor is increased. Use your brain power. If in the circuit, the resistor is replaced by a motor, in which form will the energy given by the cell get transformed into? Answer. The energy given by the cell will get transformed into the kinetic energy of the copper coil in the motor. P is equal to electrical power is equal to energy upon time required is equal to VABQ upon T is equal to VABI. Statement 1. Whereas Q upon T is equal to I. The source of energy, the cell, gives in time T the energy P into T to the resistor. If I is the current flowing continuously through the circuit, the heat produced in the resistor in time T will be H is equal to P into T is equal to VAB into I into T. Statement 2 According to Ohm's law, VAB is equal to I into R. Statement 3 H is equal to V square AB into T upon R. Statement 4. Similarly, H is equal to I into I into R into T. That is equal to I square into RT. Statement 5. H is equal to I square into R into T is called Joule's law of heating. Unit of electrical power. P is equal to VAB into I is equal to volt into ampere. Statement 6. 1 volt into 1 ampere is equal to 1J upon 1C into 1C upon 1S. Statement 7. 1J upon S is equal to W. Watt. Statement 8. Thus, the unit of electrical power is 1 watt. Think about it. How can we write mechanical power in a manner similar to the electrical power? Answer. We can write mechanical power in a manner similar to electric power as follows. Mechanical power P is equal to mechanical work W upon time T. P is equal to W upon T. 
इज इक्वल टू एफ एस कॉस्थीटा अपॉन टी 